Bishop Brandon's 47th graduating class, our class of 2014. Admittedly, 
Thinking about how I got lost back then made me realize how overwhelming school can be. Being in high school requires us to constantly balance our academic and social life. It may have been too much to handle sometimes, but luckily, our parents were there to guide us whenever we lost our way. We truly appreciate your patience and grace, because without it, we wouldn't have been able to gain the confidence that we needed to step out into the world. It is also fitting to thank and recognize our teachers who have taught us the importance of preparation, focus, and hard work. You have demanded our A game every time we walked into your class. And whether we liked it or not, we definitely benefited from it. High school is a life-defining journey, a transitional period that prepares us for adulthood. Like a roller coaster, there were twists and turns along the way, but being a part of this loving and caring Brandon community made every experience worthwhile. We can have so many wonderful memories to look back on a few years from now, such as joining clubs, watching school plays, or participating in the Water Project, student council, and social justice activities. We have been very lucky because trips to France and New York aren't done by ordinary schools. But then again, our school is far from being just ordinary. <laughs> our school has catered to every student's interests and talents. With a wide array of programs to choose from, all of us got to express ourselves, whether it was in athletics, fine arts, or career in technology studies. We were provided with opportunities to see where we excel and to find new interests that would give us ideas of what we wanted to do in the future. In the span of just three years, we have made a home out of four concrete walls on Haddon Road. We had a place where we were accepted, where we made friends, shared bonds, endured hardships, overcame adversities, and celebrated success. We were encouraged here to be the best people we can be, and we have become just that. As we look forward to what comes next, it is also apparent that we are closing the chapter on a big part of our lives. In doing so, we shouldn't feel sadness or regret. Rather, let us aspire to leave on good terms by thanking those who inspired us, remembering those who couldn't be with us, and apologizing to those who we've hurt. We are not saying goodbye. We are merely saying till we meet again. Bishop Brandon gave us the opportunity to enrich our Catholic values and faith. We have learned about our moral compass, the value of life and our responsibility to seek justice and peace through morning prayers, school liturgies, and religion classes. St. John Paul II once said, let yourselves be taken over by the light of Christ and spread that light wherever you are. What now lies before us is an opportunity to showcase that light, to showcase the knowledge and maturity that we've acquired from attending this institution. As we get ready to face new challenges in life, we carry the values and life lessons Bishop Brandon has taught us to live out our dreams, and to honor God in everything we do. No doubt all of us would have success in pursuing our dreams because we have a graduating class full of diverse and gifted individuals, each having something extraordinary to offer to the world. 20 years from now, when we meet in Hawaii for our reunion, <laughs> Are 
years, having a family of our own, and being happy with where we are at that point of our lives. We can then tell each other that we didn't do just all right, but we did great. We worked hard, surpassed expectations, and left our mark on the world. We can say that we've strived for greatness and have inspired others to do the same. The opportunity to live out our dreams can come at any moment's notice. But when it does, let us all live by what William Shakespeare once wrote. Be not afraid of greatness. Some are born great. Some achieve greatness. While others have greatness thrust upon them. Congratulations, fellow graduates, and God bless. members, 